All right, well, what I'm working on today is a 2012 GMC Arcadia. Okay, so these are the brake pads I got for it from O'Reilly. They're uh, ceramic as a factory pad material. And these are the pads, they look pretty good. The difference is, is that every pad has a little indicator, the depth indicator, noise, do that on there. And the factory pads, I've already taken the, I've already taken these little clips off, so. But I put them back on there so you could see where they were at. The factory pads had the clip on the outside, it was on the bottom. Which these are, these are in pretty good shape. They're not, eh, they got a little bit of an angle on them, but not bad. Pins look good. And this, this one on the inside, the inner pad, that little rattle clip, noise clip is on the top. And these look in good shape. They're not smoked or burned or stuck or anything like that. And when I took this one apart, I took the bottom pin bolt out. But the top one, I just slid it off and slid it up there and put it out of the way. It'll be fine. I'm not going to take this bracket off. I'm just going to clean it up real good. Wire brush, grease it. Put my new hardware on there. Call it good. The pin bolt torque is 30 foot pounds. And whenever you're doing stuff like this, you know, you always want to observe to look at your rotor surface, make sure you don't have any bad spots in it. And this one didn't have any pulsing or anything wrong with the brake pedal, but you always want to look at things and make sure it's in good shape. And I'm going to clean all this up real nice and beautiful and lube it before I put the tire and wheel assembly on there. And of course I need to depress my, uh, my caliper piston. I'm going to clean all this up, clean all this dirt off. This car goes down dirt road a lot. I'm we'll cleaning all that up, relube my pin. Just make sure you pop the cap off of the uh, the master cylinder cap so you don't pressurize the inside of the master cylinder cap and have it blow out everywhere. And put something under the car to catch it, okay? Because if you have extra brake fluid coming out, uh, it will go on the ground and contaminate the ground. We don't want to do that. So just uh, do your homework. Do a little bit of this and that. This is really not that hard of a job. Uh, you know, always check your pins. Man, if these pins aren't nice and pretty, take them out and clean them. It's not that hard. If they're stuck, get them loose and clean them or get another bracket. Because that's the reason why these these uh, brake pads get all crooked and all messed up. So, anyway, so that's going to be it for all this. Y'all have a good day.